Hey, welcome back to Input Fishing. Today I am on Lake Okissa, which is a Bill Dance signature lake in Mississippi. And it is January. It's actually January 12th. Do you know what that means? Yeah, it's my birthday. So I'm out here with my good buddy Sasha. And it is kind of cold. It's in the 30s. It just dropped last night. It's a little windy, not too bad. We're, we're out here by the dam. And we're, first, we're going to start this area with jerk baits. And then uh, we're going to go move over to uh, chatter baits. If the wind gets really bad here, we're going to go fish some back creeks and uh, look for bass that are trying to get out of the wind because I'm going to want to get out of the wind by then. It is kind of chilly today. It's in the 30s. It's in the 30s. Yeah, you're right. So look at that lake. Isn't that nice? The buoys over there, if you can see them, that's the swim area. So it's going to probably have a gravel bottom. That might be good there. Let's get it, get it going. Come on. All right, this is the first thing I'm going to throw. Don't know. Don't know who that's by, but it's a jerk bait. It's a natural color. I decided to go ahead and come and try to get out of the wind. Here's that swimming area I was talking about. This is like the uh, north boat ramp area. It's right outside of Butte, Mississippi. All right, I'm gonna fish this gravelly area of the swim area while I wait for Sasha to catch up with me. I had to go tie up. I'm throwing a rage blade with a trigger, whoa, trigger X swim bait on it. It's a baby bass. It's like four and a half inches. I'll show you in a sec. This is a this is different than what you're gonna buy at Walmart if you get the raised blade. We've modified it. A normal raised blade is not weedless. And this see how this looks different? What we've done is we've took the the hook that this comes with off and we put a a clip on there and put a, a 5 aught Texas hook on there and Texas rigged this baby bass swim bait because a lot of times when you're fishing a, a rattle, I mean not a rattle trap, a chatter bait, if this hits something it's going to flip on its side and you're going to get hung up and we want to fish some areas where there's wood and I don't want to lose these things. <laughs> Chatterbait can run you upwards of seven bucks or more. Sometimes you find them cheaper. I'm gonna do a slow retrieve. I want this to stay on the bottom. It's that vibrating action that's gonna trigger a reaction bite. All right, Sasha and I gave up on over there. Too much hydrilla. Not enough fish, but right here on the dam where we are now, as we walk along, we can see bait moving around and stuff busting it. So I'm going to put this modified chatter bait out there. I'm going to let it hit the bottom and retrieve it slow. Well, I'm not hitting any weed. I want it to vibrate, so if I retrieve it a little too slow it's just going to scrape the bottom but that's alright but I want some vibration and when I feel it go through oh you got one? no I think I got a clump of weed that's what I got I want to catch a fish for my birthday I did buy, ooh, I bought some night crawlers. <laughs> I could switch over to night crawlers. All right, I went back to the truck to get my third rod. It's my ultralight, and it has a soccer jig on it, six pound test. Now, that is a Matrix Mini, one of their dark ones, it's avocado. It's a 1 16th ounce jig head. I think there are soccer right here. Or bluegill, there's definitely bluegill. So I am going to switch because this is my birthday. I gotta catch a fish. I don't care what. But nice to get a big bass. This Bill Dance Signature Lake is famous. Oh, Lake Okissa is famous for 
big bass. But yesterday was really warm. Today is really cold, so fish might be uh, hard to catch today. Got some crappie nibbles. If this don't work, I'm gonna drop shot a night crawler. Now I got a bunch of stuff in my pocket, so if I want, I could switch things up. I got some different skirts that I put in my pocket. I've got a jig and float, but first I'm just going to put this out here. This is a short rod, so I'm not gonna be able to fish too far, but I think they're right here. This is deep water right here, but it does have a lot of hydrilla. I chose a dark, ooh, felt like a hit right there. I chose a dark bait because water's a little cloudy, but not too bad. It's really because of the overcast is why I'm going dark, but I do have some different ones in my pocket. That jig is getting me out there right where I want to get. I'll give this a bit of a go and then we're going to move down. I know you probably can't see with this camera, but there is a, some concrete structure down that way. We already lost the, the nibbler. That's all right. Somewhere up here I dropped one. Somewhere. Here it is. Some fish right here in front of us. There's some, uh, looks like a brush pile right there, too. Oh. Hit the weeds. Or maybe it was a bite. No nibbler. Let's do a few casts without nibblers. And then we're going to move on. Alright, I finally got a fish on. And I've changed spots. Ooh. I am... Wow, is, what is that? Is that a spotted bass or just a regular largemouth? <clears throat> My first birthday fish. I'm behind the dam. He's a dink, but... Ooh! He's got that tooth pad. That's a spotted bass. Yeah! Wow! Nice! That's a nice birthday. Fish hasn't caught these for a long time. Texas, last place. Here, go back. Yeah! Nice! Right over there along the wall. I'm out of the wind, so it's nice here. Let's do that again. I put a jigging float on, and that's still that Matrix Mini, that dark one. It's like an avocado and a little bit of chartreuse flake in it. All right. I'm back on the lakeside of the dam. Found Sasha. Not much going on, but he's modified. These modified chatterbaits are working out pretty good. He just lost a nice fish. Just couldn't get, get it hooked. Wow, it is so beautiful here. I'm going to sit down and wait for Sasha. Whew. It was a pretty good day, but it is freezing. Why am I saying good day? It wasn't a good day. It was really rough, dude. Yeah, it was tough conditions, man. But I got a, I got a fish for my birthday. It's just a spotted bass. I haven't caught one of those in a while. It... All right. Pretty decent day. 
except for the horrible conditions. But it was my birthday. I caught a fish. It's a nice spotted bass. I had fun. I always wanted to fish a, a signature lake by Bill Dance, especially this one. I'll have to come back on a better day when it's not uh, colder than a del or uh, colder than a well diggers. But see, it's so cold I can't talk straight. But I can think straight. I know I want to get warm. I know I want some food, and I want to go back to where my dogs are. They're here it's with me. It's 32 in degrees exactly. 32 degrees. It's freezing tits out here, man. But yeah, you gotta check it out. It's really nice. Awesome. Let's go. See you next time.